Gladstone police had search dogs out tonight hoping to find something to help them solve a murder. Now, Sayed Shabir is following this investigation and is live at the Gladstone Police Department. Yeah, Mark Krista, detectives here at the Gladstone Police Department are working around the clock this evening trying to piece together their city's third homicide of the year. Right now, they have every reason to believe that this attacker is still out there and they have no suspect information. It remains a mystery also to the people who live in this apartment building. Some of them tell me they are thinking about moving out. Search dogs scoured the wooded area behind the Mountain View Apartments Thursday evening. It was here where 52-year-old Nancy Bowman was found stabbed to death at about 6 p.m. Wednesday. We hadn't seen her in about three days. Neighbor Marcella Pachita lives on the first level of the building, just two floors beneath Bowman. She said the body was found less than 20 feet from her patio. She was multiply stabbed out there. Yeah, it, it gives me a shock. It makes me want to move. Pachito had become Bowman's friend, driving her to the grocery store and watching her on her daily walks. She's a normal walker every day, so when you don't see somebody walking, you know that something isn't, isn't quite right. Also not right was the smell. I, think I smelled something on um, Sunday. But I thought it was the sewer system. Pachito says the sour smell grew stronger as the days passed, but she thought it was a dead animal. I wish that Sunday when I made that smell, that I thought it was just a dead animal, that I would have went out and, and searched. It's a regret, she says, she won't soon shake. She was a very, very kind person, like I said, but I, I can't think of anybody who would want to hurt her. Now, because police do not have any suspect information, they're calling on the people who know Bowman and asking them if they know where she was seen last, who she was seen last with, or where she was seen last. All of these are pieces that they need to solve this uh, homicide investigation. They're asking anyone to call the TIPS hotline, 816-474-TIPS. We're live tonight in Gladstone, Sayed Shabir, 41 Action News.